Hi everyone, welcome to another question and answer session. A 17 years old male has a suspected testicular pressure and the scrotum is to be explored surgically. The surgeon incised the skin and then the datus muscle. What is the next tissue layer that will be encountered during the dissection? So after careful reading, now we have to find out the main point or key point here for answer the question. So here we can see 17 years old male suspected testicular pressure and scrotum is explored surgically. Surgeon inside the skin and help and then the datus muscle. So skin and datus muscle has been dissected. Then we have to find out what is the next layer. So actually they want to know the different layer of the scrotum and the testis. So here the options. Options are visceral layer of the tunica vaginalis. Chemasteric fascia, parietal layer of tunica vaginalis, and external spermatic fascia, internal spermatic fascia. So we have to find out on of the layer, and this layer is located just below the datus muscle because skin and the uh, datus muscle are explored. So the next next layer we have to find out. So in this picture we can see the different layers of the scrotum here, and we can see the finally testis, which is located into the scrotum so here we can see first of all outside all of them in the scrotum first of all this is the skin then datus muscle so this reddish structure is the datus muscle and just inside the datus muscle there is spermatic external spermatic fascia so this layer this green layer is external spermatic fascia then we can see there is a muscle and fascia so it is the cremastic muscle and fascia here uh, this reddish area is the muscle and the area between the muscle is the fascia so it is the cremastic muscle and fascia then we can see in a layer internal spermatic fascia and muscle and uh, internal spermatic fascia and finally it is the testis so these are the layers of the scrotum again is skin datus muscle then external spermatic fascia then cremastic muscle and fascia and internal spermatic fascia so it is now clear for us that the just beneath the datus muscle there is a fascia and this fascia is the external spermatic fascia so these are the layers of the scrotum in this picture we also can see here this is the testis and outside the testis there are the different layers First of all, here we can see the skin, then datus muscle, then skin, datus muscle, then we can see these three structures, external spermatic fascia, cremastic muscle and fascia, and internal spermatic fascia. So just below the datus muscle, there is a fascia, which is the external spermatic fascia. So here, in written form, the layers of scrotum, there are a mnemonics that some damn Englishmen call it the testis. Here, S for skin, D for datus, fascia and muscle, E for uh, external spermatic fascia, C for chemistic muscle and fascia, I for internal spermatic fascia and T for tunica vaginalis and T for testis. So this is the mnemonic, some, some damn Englishmen call it the testis. So our final answer is ready now that the just behind the uh, datus muscle there is the layer this layer is the external spermatic fascia on the other hand we can see the tunica vaginalis uh, vaginal layer tunica vaginalis it is actually not layer of scrotum it is a layer of the testis then cremastric muscle and fascia it lies in either side of the external spermatic fascia then parietal layer of tunica vaginalis it also the uh here we can see it is the most inner layer of the scrotum then internal spermatic fascia it is one of the layer but it also uh, depart to the cremastic muscle and fascia. So our answer now is external spermatic fascia and this external spermatic fascia, it lies the inner side of the datus muscle. And here again, the layers in order, first of all, skin, then datus muscle, then external spermatic fascia, cremastic muscle and fascia, then internal spermatic fascia and parietal layer of tunica vaginalis. Thank you all.